Outrun has to be one of the most confusingly titled video game franchises. The game's main series consists of four games developed by AM2, but the latest game in the series is the one named Outrun 2. The first follow-up to Outrun came in the form of Turbo Outrun, and the reason why it isn't classed as a fully-fledged sequel is because the game's original 1989 arcade release was marketed as a conversion kit for existing Outrun units. However, the version of the game we're looking at here is the home console port for the Mega Drive. The game itself is a peculiarly stripped-back affair. The branching paths of the original have been dumped in favour of a linear series of stages that see you driving from New York to Los Angeles. The game has 16 stages in all, and they're split into four sections. After each section, you get the option to upgrade a part of your car to help with the next. The main gameplay differences come in a few areas. Firstly, there is now a rival racer driving a Porsche 959, and he will aggressively shunt you out of the way. Secondly, you can now get arrested by the police if you crash in an area where they are chasing. Finally, we have the most significant change, the turbo boost. Pressing the C button allows you to boost for a short period of time, and it's imperative you take every opportunity to use the boost, as it's necessary for making it to the next checkpoint in time. The game is actually quite a nice looking little title, considering it's an early Mega Drive release. The stages are all detailed and nicely varied, and there's plenty of other traffic and obstacles to worry about. Some might say there's a little too much littering the road, as it becomes increasingly difficult to avoid these obstacles, and the resulting collisions cost precious time. Sadly, one of the most disappointing features of the game is the soundtrack, which pales in comparison to the original Outrun. The songs are simply background noise, and the one that accompanies the first section is a particularly grating one. This is a real shame, because the original trilogy of songs from the first Outrun are masterful in their execution, and they really help heighten the feeling of driving across great expanses in your open-top Ferrari. So is Turbo Outrun a worthy addition to your collection? Perhaps. The game is certainly a well-executed and challenging racer that is easy to learn and difficult to master. However, it does feel somewhat unfair thanks to the sheer onslaught of obstacles it throws at you, and the soundtrack unfortunately reduces the game to a pretty forgettable experience.